Hi, I'm Sean Gann, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about add and subtracting fractions and mixed numbers and evaluate each expression. So, if I was given these numbers, negative 3 and 5 eighths minus 4 and 2 fifths, okay? So, first thing I want to do is break this down, all right, to have our whole numbers and our fractions for each one. So, your negative 3 plus a negative 5 eighths. And then subtracting, the same thing as adding a negative plus a negative 4 plus a negative 2 fifths. Make sure you bring the negative to both parts. So now we're going to add our whole numbers. Negative 4 and uh, negative 3 is a negative 7. But our fractions, I'm going to do that work over here. All right, so we can't add them directly. Negative 5 eighths plus a negative 2 fifths. Well, they have to have the same denominator to add them. So what I'm going to do is multiply the second number by 8 over 8, which is comes from this denominator, and the first number by 5 over 5, which comes from this denominator here. All right. Multiplying them across, 5 times negative 5 is negative 25, and 5 times 8 is 40. Then negative 2 times 8 is negative 16, and 5 times 8 is 40 again. So now we have the same base. We just add the numerators here, okay? And so we have negative 25 plus negative 16. Well, negative uh, 25 and negative 16. Well, 1 plus 2 is 3, right? So we have 30. And then the 5 and 6 is 11. So 30 and 11, all right, come out to be negative uh, 41. So you have negative 41 right here over 40. Okay, and if I want to write that, uh, break that down, right, to be a whole number in a fraction, that would be negative 1 plus a negative 1 over 40, right, because uh, 40 goes into 41 one time, boom, and we're left with 1 left over, 1 over 40, and they're all negative, okay? Bring that over here, plus a negative 1 plus a negative 1 over 40, all right. So now we have negative 7 plus a negative 1, which is a negative 8. Okay, and then we bring down the negative 1 over 40. That's a negative 1 over 40 right there. Okay, and now combine these two, they're both negative, so we can write it as one number easily negative 8 and 1 over 40. And that's our final answer. So, quick recap we're given negative 3 and 5 eighths minus 4 and 2 fifths. Okay. Well, first we, uh, I broke that down and then combined our whole numbers and our fractions, right? Broke it down to be whole numbers and fractions. Whole number added to be negative 7, and our fractions came out to be negative 1 and negative 1 over 40. Brought that over here. Again, combined the whole numbers. Then added the fraction in there to get a final answer of negative 8 and 1 over 40.